the Safan Hassan marathon debut in London. Why is now the right time for you to make your marathon debut? Um, it is really the time I didn't really, really think about it. One day I just wake up and like I'm really curious out late and um, I just uh, I, I just say one day okay I wanna do some new and at the marathon because I already did just so many things in track and I was like Sandy okay I wanna do marathon. That's the challenge. I really like challenge and. Uh, that's when I decided and they, I talked to my manager and that they was count up uh, some marathon. I was like, no, I want to do London. Because London, they always have the greatest athlete, the fastest athlete. And it is also like very, you know, you always curious who's going to win. And I just the one, then decided to say, okay, you know, I'm very curious. I'm really, I like challenging. So I want to challenge you today, the fastest woman and the strongest woman and see how long I can keep up with them. Have you enjoyed marathon training? I, I didn't really done that much marathon training because when I start marathon training, Ramadan come and it's uh, marathon training actually you have to make a lot of mileage. And uh, that's, I didn't really make that mileage because it's like uh, will fast and doing a lot of mileage is very hard. Mm -hmm. But is it my even uh, what funny thing my training is not that great, so I'm gonna see. Uh, and I do also I did move total from track to the marathon, so I'm just in between. I'm doing track and I'm doing also marathon. I can't say I'm doing total marathon and I enjoy or something because I'm not really doing all marathon today. Yeah, Ramadan just ended today. What was the biggest challenge for you training for the marathon during Ramadan? Yeah, when I do the longer distance, like long run, and I just like you know I don't uh, drink. And that's the biggest challenge, also the biggest fear for my world also, because I didn't practice, do run and uh, long run and uh, drinking. And I don't know what to gonna do to my body neither, and now uh, fast the whole month and not to uh, suddenly I give to my stomach uh, so much drink, I don't know what is gonna happen. That's also, I'm really, I'm really nervous about it also. What was the longest run you did in training? I did like 41 something. Well, I fasted. Yeah. This is very hard. Yeah. <laughs> this is really hard. <laughs> this is like, I'm so, but I'm like in the end, though, so I'm very happy when I break the fast in the night and uh, we have water. I'm so grateful. I'm, I'm really happy and I was like thankful and for whatever I have and for the life also. Yeah. Do you think it's been harder or easier training to prepare for a marathon versus training to prepare to triple in Tokyo? It's, um, the triple had uh, like I had for almost uh, three, four months in my head, I was suffering. But this almost for one month, I was like, sometimes I wake up, I was like, what the hell I decide to run this pretty? Why I, I decided running this marathon, you know? Why I decided? And, but in the, in the, in the, in, uh, in the end, you know, and then I was like, I tell myself, I learn from that. And I did the same in Tokyo, so like, why the hell I decided this? Why I put myself to do so much pressure? Yeah. And this also happened when I was like, okay, yeah, it's just, in the end, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be over. Yeah. I tell myself, and like, yeah. See, it was, it's a really challenge. It's almost the same. It's almost the same. It's like, come to my mind, so thousand things done. Especially when you, when I was fasting, I was like, why decide this? Why, why? Sometimes I wake up like, I wish it's just like, I didn't say that I'm gonna run or something. Yeah. It's kind of funny for me. How? What would be a successful London marathon for you? Is it a time? Is it just finishing the race? Learning experience? Uh, for me, whether I uh, like, whether I'm good time, bad time, the most important thing is the finish and learning. So next time, I always have a hard also as a. As, as a human being, I always have uh, the new things. I always curious about, also nervous. But now, if I know, I learn this, and I know next time what to do and, and how to improve. The other thing myself. I was going to say, you mentioned about the World Championships, and then you mentioned maybe doing a marathon kind of towards the end of the year, something like Valencia, which is quite a quick mm, marathon. I I don't know. I don't know which one is, but I really uh, because this one I didn't even have great preparation. And uh, I just, uh, I learn, I see here what I'm gonna do, and then I really wanna do a, 
uh, after, after the water the, the last thing for me, if you've got a message to the thousands of runners who are taking part in London this weekend, what inspirational message would you have for them? Just to suffer like me, <laughs> see what we're gonna do together. <laughs> have fun, and I just told them have fun. Just uh, see the new journey where where it take. I'm I'm doing the same with them, so that them just say okay, let's find out what it's gonna be.